Okay, what's up, YouTube? It's Pacey AI one more time. About to bring you another video. Remember to leave a like, share, and subscribe. I want to talk to you guys about Vidnaz AI. Now, this is a great platform that allows you to create videos in a variety of ways. And one way in particular that I'm going to be describing is the realistic AI avatars and how you can use these AI avatars to essentially create videos. So if you go on the homepage, you actually see popular templates that are trending and then you can actually select any one of these templates to go ahead and create a video. Now I want to create a news video. So I'm just going to go ahead and pick Welcome this template. Welcome to this video news, create videos to report breaking news. And essentially we have our avatar right here. Now you can change this avatar to whatever you want, but you can essentially have it as a circle head. You can, change her to a half body you can change it to a square head so let's keep it at a half body right here what i want to do though i want to have this as a conversation so as you can see i have two avatars right here now i can change the avatar that i want to display right here so if i want to display her i can do that and if i want to change his avatar and i want to change it to him i could do that right now I can have a conversation between these two avatars for this video. I can have the image right here. So the image is essentially going to be describing what the news is talking about. So I generated this news script from chat GPT about this article, this crypto article on crypto market set for a comeback as Ethereum prepares for the Petra upgrade. So I, generated this script and then what I'm going to be doing I'm going to just be copying this and I'm going to go back to Vidnaz and I'm going to essentially have the first news anchor start the conversation then I'm going to have the second news anchor so let me go over here paste that over here so as you can see I added exactly what each news anchor is going to say so essentially this is our script. Let me go back over here. This is our script. He's going to say, good evening, welcome. And then she's going to follow up on what he said. He's going to follow up on that. And then she's going to end the conversation. So I can go ahead and generate that. So while that video is generating, I want to show you guys how you can actually edit the images on the templates. If you want to change the image, so you would click here. And then you can actually change your image to different images from different providers. So you have free pick and on splash. These are the two providers that they use. So if I want to talk about crypto, I could just type in crypto right here and it will give me different images of cryptocurrency. So I could just put that as my image. And obviously we do have subtitles. So this will be your, your subtitles right here. You know, if you take that off, as you can see, you don't have your subtitles, put that on. That's your subtitles and you can change the font of your subtitle. You can change it to whatever you want. I'll just put it back at part of one. You can change this text to whatever you want. You can basically pick the, take the headline from the actual news that you're doing it about. So you can just put that there and that will be fine. If you want to change your avatar, you can go ahead change your avatar. You have different avatars or you have pro avatars. Uh, you got talking photos right here. So if you want to use a talking photo instead of an avatar, you can do that too. But essentially you have pro avatars. So if I want to use her instead, I can do that. Yeah, you can add certain animations to this. So if I want like an animation for this, I can do that. I can, I have like a scale animation on the entry and the exit. If I want to change it to fade on the en entry and the exit, I want to do that. I can do that as well. Uh, if I, and then I just click set and then you can determine where on the timeline you want this image to show. Obviously for this particular video, I want it to show on the whole timeline, but let's say you want to change this image up, right? You could set this image up to this point. Then you can duplicate this image and you can change that image to something else, right? You can probably change that image to say this, and then you can have this image show up on a different timeline. So you'd put this here 
right? And that this image will show at that time, essentially. So you can actually determine when you want to show your images. In terms of the background, you can change the background to whatever you want. So if I do that, I change the background to that. I can also say news to see if I can get other backgrounds. So that's the current background that they're giving me, but I can also use my own backgrounds as well. So I can upload any image, right? You can generate an image of a background using any AI tool, and then you can go ahead and up upload that. You have office. So if I wanted to do this, I can do that as well. So really, really cool different shapes. You can add different shapes and add that to different images and things like that. Tons of stuff that you can do right here. You have, as I touched on music, you can decide what music you want. You can add music to the video. So you can say to this scene only or to all scenes. If you want to add that to all scenes, you can go ahead and do that. And then you have your different things. If you want to crop this avatar, you can do that. Crop out her picture. If you just want to show her as a circle, you can go ahead and do that. And it will essentially crop out her picture like that. Obviously now she is kind of circular as you guys can see. And if you go undo, you can just undo that. You can also add video. So if I, instead of a image right here, I wanted it to be a video. I can just go ahead and remove that. I can remove all of this. If I want a Bitcoin video, let's say I could just type Bitcoin and get it from pixels. So pixels is their provider right here. And obviously you can see different videos right here. I could take that video. I could put that here. I can stretch it to make it fit this little box right here. I can also adjust the size of that box to fit this video in particular. So I can do something like that. Align it like that. And there we go. So now I have a video showing crypto stuff and then I can have her talk about crypto. So I can have her basically read out this whole script like that. I just, paste the script here. Now I can also do an AI script. So I can just put the script here and I could click generate as well and have it just generate me the script. So I can put something that I want the script to be about and it will generate me the script. I can even shorten the script if I think it's too long. So let me just put this as my script. This is what I want her to say. I could add word pronunciation. I could also do AI translation. I can change the language and things like that. So a whole lot of things you can do here. I can, once I'm done with this, I could click generate and I could go ahead and generate the video. I can also export the avatar only. So essentially if I don't want the entire thing and I just want the talking avatar to use in another video, I can do that as well. But you click generate and it will go ahead and generate your video. So the conversation video is not done generating, so I'll let you guys watch that. Good evening, and welcome. Our top story today centers around an exciting development in the crypto world as Ethereum prepares for its latest upgrade, known as Pectra. This upgrade, expected in early 2025, aims to bring significant improvements to the Ethereum network. So, what's making waves with Pectra? Well, one big focus is boosting Ethereum's performance in data handling and smart contract functionality. Plus, it may reduce the 32 ETH staking requirement, allowing more users to participate in staking. Experts say this could reignite interest in Ethereum and even the wider crypto market, which has seen a recent downturn. Exactly, and with crypto enthusiasts calling this a potential golden bottom, it's looking like Ethereum could lead a market comeback. Let's see how this impacts the market as the Pectra upgrade date draws nearer. It's an exciting time for crypto. Stay with us for updates on this and other crypto trends. Also, this is the other video that I generated with the One News Anchor, so you guys can check this out as well. Ethereum is set to undergo a significant upgrade called Pectra in early 2025. This upgrade will enhance data management and smart contract functionalities. 
One exciting aspect is the potential reduction of the 32 ETH staking requirement, making staking more accessible. This upgrade is generating optimism in the cryptocurrency community, with some seeing it as a potential market turning point. The anticipation of Pectra is expected to bring new momentum to Ethereum and the broader market. Stay tuned for further updates on this development and its impact on the crypto space. So all in all, as you guys can see, Vidnaz AI is a great platform, very good platform for generating videos. This avatar feature, I think, is very good. And it allows you to really generate dynamic content. If you want to start like a 24-7 news channel, let's say, you could do that very easily. You can go online get news and essentially just create videos and then live stream it on your YouTube channel, on your social media account, wherever it is, it's very easy to do this. There's nothing really for you to do more than just get a script from chat GPT, paste it in here, add a few images here and there, change your avatars up and change your background to whatever you want it to look like. And then you have your video. So let me know what you guys think about this. I will be doing a lot more videos like this in the future. Remember to leave a like, share, and subscribe. Have a great day. Pacey AI signing out.